So before this video truly begins, I would like to say that any statements expressed in this video do not express any of my true feelings toward the series itself, and that everything is said is intended for purposes of satire and comedy. In case you didn't hear that, I will repeat that this video is intended for satire and comedy. So if you take the title at face value and go to the comments section to bitch about it, I will laugh mercilessly at your stupidity. <laughs> to throw a shovel at your head. When my dad sees this report card, he's gonna flip. <laughs> I'm so sorry! You did this to me! Ah! Garnet! Quick! You have to pretend to be my mom to Connie's mom. Hello. This is Mom Universe. Yes, the children are playing swords. Sorry, playing with swords. They're bleeding. Oh no, they are dead. Don't call again. Sorry. I panicked. Hey, how you doing? Well, I'm doing just fine. I lied, I'm dying inside. Sure, you may be verified on Twitter, but are you verified in the eyes of God? Just make myself some toast. Who put the toaster oven on six? I mean, that's not even good toast. Four is good toast. Five is burnt toast, but six... WHAT WERE YOU CREMATING IN MY TOASTER OVEN?! Go back to school with Kate. HIT ME! HIT ME WITH YOUR CAR! HE'S COMING! Okay. I COME EVERY TIME YOU COME AROUND MY- AHHHHHH! AH JEEZ! Ah, no one ever asks how the table feels. My name is Maria Juanita Graciela Carolina Isabela Fernanda Rafaela Manuela Palwin. If you ever want to see your family again, count to ten. One, three, five, seven, nine. What about the even numbers? Again, even. Today we remember the life of Lynn because we love his you now. I'm sorry, but we shut up, Harry. We will miss you, Len. I just had one to all Tori. No, no, guys, why are you more me? You know what we more tell? Huh, Len? So, Karasu, today we have left this. Why do we have a vodka stack every day? Me to shut to the head up. Fine. What is the test about? It was the fit of a sugram face of test. Even worse. Yeah, you agree with Nono. I don't get to pay the end of all this. I am Coach Kaito. Now run five million laps now. I wanna be dead at the end of this. At the end. Oh, truly, where am I at? How do I know? As I'll be going to them. Hold the quote. Yeah. Oh, Tori, that is the class at slap. What should I do? Listen to your heart. <gasps> Girl, that is not real advice. You hear this sh? I told your friend dumb as fuck. What the? He's not cheating on you. I knew that little boot that was cheating on you. I loves you. I'd kill him for you. Just talk to him. Let's kill him. No, 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 She's no, 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 no. He's coming. Hey, baby. <laughs> Day, my friend Mondo tells me, Gabriel, you know what? 
Felipe is always messing with us. Why don't you mess with him? I go, what should I do? He goes, well, why don't you crank call him? I go, dude, <laughs> that's a good idea. <laughs> like a little kid, right? I picked up the phone. I was like, doo, doo, doo. Hello? Hello, sir. Hi, this is the front desk. Listen, we're having a report of a lot of noise coming from your room. Do you think you could please keep the noise down? Oh, I'm sorry, fool. I didn't know I was making noise. Thank you, sir. Please keep it down. Okay. Ten minutes later, called them back. Hello? Hello, sir! Hi, front desk again. Listen, obviously you did not understand what I said earlier about the noise. You need to keep the noise down. But I'm not making... Sir, listen! You either keep down the noise, or we're going to call the authorities. Okay. I'm sorry. Thank you. And before I hung up the phone, I said this. Damn Mexicans. <laughs> Woo, you guys swear to God, the Mexican revolution started all over again. Man. He was mad. He came running over to the room, right? He started pounding on the door, right? <laughs> Open the door. Alright, shut up, dude, shut up, shut up. <laughs> shut up! <laughs> What's up, dude? Fool, you're not gonna believe it. This hotel is racist. Really? Why do you say that? Fool, I lay at the front desk. She doesn't like Mexicans. Well, what are you going to do about it? Fool, I'm going to go shoot her. <laughs> Dude, don't go shooting anybody. Maybe you just need to go talk to her. Talk. Mondo, tell him, yeah, you should go talk. Fool, that's what I'm going to do. So he starts walking away. I'm like, Mondo, we got to see this, right? <laughs> so we start following him towards the lobby, right? Felipe gets mad halfway and starts running. I'm like, Dude, don't run, me and Mondo. Hercules, Hercules. <laughs> to run Felipe makes it to the lobby like 30 seconds before we do right and keep in mind the girls at the counter they don't know what's going on they're doing their job they're checking people in they're giving out keys right they're like okay thank you please come again okay here you go all right here's your keys i here okay and here comes Felipe right <laughs> okay which one of your bitches said Mexican <laughs> and they started freaking out oh my god there's an angry Latino Oh my God, look, it's not my fault the Raiders lost, okay? <laughs> Don't take it out on me, please, okay? So he keeps yelling at him, going back and forth, right, this and that. Finally, Mondo and I make it to the lobby, all winded, right? <laughs> <laughs> Fool, shut up. You don't know what's going on. Felipe, I can explain everything. Fool, shut the hell up. All of a sudden, a security guard comes in, grabs Felipe, and starts trying to put him down. Right? I'm like, oh, should I let this get out of hand? <laughs> like, I got to break this up. Felipe, let me explain. Fool, shut the hell up. So I grabbed his ear, and I said, Sir! <laughs> You're going to need to keep the noise down.
fofo? Was that you? Yes, sir. You're an asshole, fool. I know, sir. But it was funny, huh? What's the buttons? No, no, they installed voice recognition technology in this lift. They heard about us. Voice recognition technology? In a lift? In Scotland? You ever tried voice recognition technology? No. They don't do Scottish accents. Eleven. Could you please repeat that? Eleven. 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 Could you please repeat that? Eleven. Whose idea was this? You need to try an American accent. Eleven. <laughs> Eleven. That sounds Irish, not American. Not Disney. Eleven. Where in America is that? Dublin. I'm sorry. Could you please repeat that? Try an English accent, right? <clears throat> Eleven. <laughs> Eleven. You for the same part of England as Dick Van Dyke? I'm saying you're saying smartass. Please speak slowly and clearly. Smartass. Eleven. I'm sorry. Could you please repeat that? Eleven. If you don't understand the lingo, a way back came to your own country. Ooh. Is that talk now, is it? A way back to your own country? Oh, don't start, Mr. Bleeding Heart. How can you be racist to a lift? Please speak slowly and clearly. Eleven. 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 You're just saying it the same way. I'm going to keep saying it until I understand Scottish, all right? Eleven. 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 I'll just take it anywhere you can. Just open the doors. This is a voice-activated elevator. Please state which floor you would like to go to in a clear and calm manner. Calm. Calm. Where's that coming from? Why is it telling people to be calm? Because they knew they'd be selling us to Scottish people who'd be going out for nuts at it! You have not selected a floor. Aye, we have! Eleven! If you would like to get out of the elevator without selecting a floor, simply say, open the doors, please. Please? Please? Suck my wally. Maybe we should just say please. I'm not begging that for nothing. Open the doors, please. Please. Pathetic. Please remain calm. Oh, you went up tonight. Get him up now. Are you just waiting for it to speak? You have not selected a floor. Ah, girls, you cow. You know what's in these doors? I'm going to come to America. I'm going to find whatever desperate actress gave you a voice, and I'm going to go in an electric chair for you. Scotland, you bastard. Scotland! 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 Freedom! 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 Have you ever wanted to play a game with your parents? Well, introducing Beat the Parents, a fun game for the whole family. Hey, Mom! Your turn. Ah! Beat the Parents from Kmart. Honey, I'm pregnant. I can explain. That was a good-ass night's sleep, bitch. I feel rejuvenated, refreshed. Oh hell, I got sleep paralysis, don't I? Sh okay, Randy, just just move your fingers and you'll be good and you'll be awake in no time. One, two, three. <laughs> it's not even working. Is that? Wow, and my closet open too big. Ain't that a mother? I might as well just die.
My sisters. What the f was that? My sisters. Oh my. Ready, smile. One, two. Mom, no, stop. And three. Look how beautiful. <laughs> Resolution. You could lose a few. You could be less lazy. Don't be such a bitch. Hey, okay, damn! Shit! Hello. 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 Hello from the other side. For the weather and Chris, back to you. Thanks, Billy. See, I do. Yo, do you have paper towels? Yeah, right up there. And here is our wonderful English class. Why life is a literature! Hello? Hey, what's up? I need your help. Can you come here? Ugh, I can't. I'm buying clothes. Alright, well hurry up and come over here. Well, I can't find them. What do you mean you can't find them? I can't find them. There's only soup. What do you mean there's only soup? It means there's only soup. Well then get out of this soup aisle! Alright, you don't have to shout at me! There's more soup! What do you mean there's more soup? There's just more soup! Go into the next aisle! There's still soup! Where are you right now? I'm at soup! What do you mean you're at soup? I mean I'm at soup! What store are you in? I'm at the soup store! Why are you buying clothes at the soup store? Fuck you! When he doesn't answer your text, it's okay to go over to his house and make sure he's not cheap. I mean, he's okay. You in there? At home as we anticipate an exciting game on Thursday, New Year's Day at the Bridgestone NHL Winter Classic. Bruh. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Ready or not, here I... I can see you! Can I get a waffle? Can I please get a waffle? Mm -hmm. He rolled up with me. You never had a boyfriend. I know. I just wanted to see if you cared. Oh my god. Care? Yes, Ben. Are you coming out with us? Can I got the baby? We're going shoe shopping. Coming back. At this moment, Jackson knew. He f up. Yo. Turn up.
trains. Oh, all right. TV for sale. Yeah, it's for sale. Yeah, how much? One dollar. Only a dollar? Just one dollar. How come it's so cheap? Oh, because the volume's turned all the way up. You can't adjust it. It's stuck that way. So the volume's always turned up? Yep. And it's only a dollar? Yeah, it's one dollar. Because the volume's turned all the way up? Yep. Wow. Can't turn that down. Hey, wake up. I'm so scared. So you're uh, you're Asian, right? Yeah. So what kind of knees are you? Knees? A knees like Chinese, Japanese, Vietnamese, Korean knees. If you take a piece of my food, you take a piece of my heart, aka, don't do that shit. Shut the fuck up. Let go. Die, please. I am joining. I go. Boss you. Hey, die. Go, Jess. It was a dark and stormy night. They were all alone. Just then, the phone rang. <gasps> Hello? Ah! What? what? My hair appointment was canceled! Ah! <sighs> yeah. Just dropping in? Oh god. No! My hero. My back. Ask a child if he or she is choking. Are you choking? Are you choking? Is you blind?
Can I borrow twenty dollars? What do you think I'm made of money? Isn't that what mom stands for? Oh shit. Why do girls keep clapping at me when they talk? You're not listening! Should I respond like I'm really, really sorry? Ugh, I have no friends. Ahem. <clears throat> Bitch, what am I? A roach? Okay, everyone dump their candy bags. Oh mom, I got a Snickers. Mom, I got a dick. Yeah, it says fun side. I'm staying alive! Rise for our national anthem. It's Britney, bitch. Up in the sky, it's a bird. It's a plane. It's Britney, bitch. Every time they turn the light. Bruh. Rachel is so annoying. I heard you were talking shit about me. What the fuck? You and me, any day. Love your hair. What? No, I, I, I love the air. <laughs> She came in. It's fine. It's okay. Help me, you. Yeah, but that backflip, though. Oh, my ass. Well, wait a minute. Do you have pants on? Are you guys fucking? Um, no, I'm not. Are you serious? It's not what it looks right like. Right in front of my salad? It's not you what it looks like. You guys are fucking um, gross. What are you waiting for? I know I will never be in a jail ever, ever, ever. You doubt, you doubt me. And I. Uh, clear your throat. <clears throat> and I. Uh, Can I get your name, please? Yes. My name is Maria Juanita Graciela Carolina Isabela Fernanda Rafaela Manuela Palwin. Can I get a waffle? Can I please get a waffle? Have you ever wanted to play a game with your parents? Well, introducing Beat the Parents, a fun game for the whole family. Hey, Mom! Your turn. Ah! Beat the Parents from Cayman. Uh, who is this? <laughs> oh, is okay, help me! Oh, my God! <laughs> Marinette? Oh, are you crying? No, I'm not. I can sense that you don't like me, but I don't understand why. We barely know each other. Miss Show Up here was trying to impress you. Don't tell me it's because of this new seating arrangement in class. It is! Of course, you were jealous because I'm sitting next to Adrian. Because you would have given anything to sit there yourself. You know what? It's really not worth fighting over a boy. You and I could be friends, and who knows, I might even be able to help you with Adrian. <laughs> you and I will only be friends the day you stop lying, Lila. <gasps> I can't prove it, but I know for a fact that you don't have tinnitus, that your wrist is just fine, that you don't know Prince Ellie because you've never even set foot in a chew, and despite what you got Alia to write on her lady blog, Ladybug has never saved your life. <gasps> I only tell people what they want to hear. It's called lying. There's nothing you can do about it anyway. People can't resist when they hear what they like to hear. If you don't want to be my friend, fine. But soon you won't have any friends left at all. And trust me, I'll make sure you never get close to Adrian in class or anywhere. You seem a little less dumb than the others, so I'll give you one last chance. You are either with me or against me. You don't have to answer right away. I'll give you till the end of class today. Oh, oh. How you doing? Well, I'm doing just fine. I lied, I'm dying inside.